Hello my beautiful friends, it's Mimi here today and today I'm going to share with you how to do this really cool braid. Technically this is not a braid but we're not going to tell anyone. If you like to learn how to do new braids or if you're struggling with creating a regular fishtail braid because let's be honest it's a bit complicated when you first learn it then you're going to love this hair tutorial. I'm probably going to call this a faux fishtail braid because it kind of looks like a fishtail braid but really it's a completely different technique. It's very easy, it's very cute so let's just get started. All right, the first thing I'm gonna do is give my hair a quick brush and I usually put my hair on the left side because I prefer to do braids on the left side, but you can do left or right, whatever works the best for you. And I'm wearing my Luxie hair extensions for thickness and length because without my Luxies, my braids just don't look the same. All right, so once I've brushed the hair and made sure there are no tangles, I'm going to section it. So first I'm gonna, I still have sort of a side bang, so I'm just gonna remove this because it's gonna get in the way as I'm braiding. So I'm just gonna pick it up and just do something like this so it's not in the way. I don't have a clip with me, so I'll just do this. It might look a little funny for the time being. Stay. Okay, I think it's gonna stay there. All right, so working with this section, that doesn't have layers, or mostly doesn't have layers. I'm gonna grab a big section here in the middle, just like that, and I'm gonna grab a clear hair elastic. Maybe just a bit more here. So nice and thick section here, and I'm gonna secure it with the clear hair elastic. And then once this is secured, I'm just gonna do the opening over the hair elastic. So create an opening and pull the ends of the hair through the opening. So that's the first one. Then I'm gonna take more hair from the sides. So again, I'm working with quite big sections here. So one section here, one section from the left, and sort of bring it right under that elastic. So sort of even covering the hair elastic. So I'm gonna bring the two together just like that, and then do the same thing. I'm gonna secure it with the hair elastic. Once this is secured with the hair elastic, I'm gonna do the same thing, because this one already has the opening, so I don't even need to split the hair. I'm just gonna bring the ends of the ponytail through there, and just push it a little up, just like that. So you wanna make sure that it's all like layered under each other. Moving on, I'm gonna continue doing this all the way down, so again, grabbing sections from the outside, one from the left, one from the right, bring them together, and secure the hair elastic again. And then take the ends and bring it through. Now I'm gonna continue doing the exact same thing all the way down. And now I'm just on the last section, so I'm gonna do the exact same thing. Bring the two sections together, secure it with an elastic, make sure that you don't grab other hair or layers, because then it becomes a bit tangled. All right, then just use that opening to bring the ends through, then push through the elastic, just like that. And we're finished with the braid, but we're not finished with styling the braid. So this is what it looks like initially. Now I'm gonna just bring the hair back where it was before and fix my parting. Now I've got a lot of layers sort of hanging out. I'm gonna grab a few bobby pins and pin them in the back just because I feel like there's just a bit too many of them and it looks a bit too messy for my liking. So I'm just gonna use a few bobby pins to pin these layers in the back. All right, so I'm left with these bangs. I'm gonna curl them in a moment, but before I curl the hair, I'm just gonna go into the braid and really fan it out. So that's exactly where the magic happens. So basically, I'm gonna go into every single strand that I created, starting from the top, and carefully hold with the left hand or the right hand and pull on the other one. And you wanna pull slowly and carefully on every section. This way, it's not too messy. So as you can see, I'm just holding the braid with one hand and pulling with the other. And as I'm pulling, you can see it's creating this massive braid. And it looks even better if you have any highlights in your hair or if you're wearing hair extensions like me with highlights or ombre.
All right, I think at this point, I'm pretty happy with the size of this braid. It's quite gigantic as it is. And as you can see, it looks very cool because it sort of looks like a fishtail, but it's not really a fishtail because it's not going sort of in a downward, it's going more straight. And I really love the effect. I mean, it looks super awesome. Now, the next step is to wave these sections because they're just kind of straight and in my face. So I'm gonna grab a curling one and curl my bangs away from the face. So I'm gonna start from the middle of the bangs and just wrap it around the barrel and hold it for about 12 to 15 seconds. Kind of looks like a rib cage too. It's a weird comparison, but what do you guys think? What does it look like? Let me know in the comment below. Okay, so hold it for a few seconds and then I'm just gonna release it in my palm. I'm going to let it set in my palm for five seconds and then just release that. I'm gonna do the same thing with the first section here. Just wrap it around, start sort of in the middle of the section. Hold it for 10 to 15 and then release it in my palm. Let it set for a few seconds. Okay, I'm not gonna leave it like that, don't worry. And then I'm gonna do the same thing here. Curl it away from the face. It would be funny if I did leave it like that. Just a few seconds, all right. So now I'm just gonna go into the section that's curled and sort of run my fingers through it. And I'm just gonna brush through the bangs to open them up and soften them. I'm just gonna pin this longer section back. And that is it, we're finished. for you guys today let me know what you think I think this braid is pretty awesome leave me a comment down below I absolutely love reading your comments give this video a big thumbs up that will totally make my day and when you recreate this hairstyle because I know you will make sure to post it on your Instagram with hashtag Luxie hair thank you guys so much for tuning in I'll see you next week love you bye